bolt.diy running locally on your computer and in this video we are using free large language models from open router through an api key open router is a platform where we can actually access large language models and there are a lot of free large language models available in here you can use deepseek r1 distilled with llama 70b absolutely for free you can use deepseek r1 absolutely for free. similarly you can use something like quant 2.5 that too absolutely for free and even you can use google gemini pro 2.0 absolutely for free let me just show you the speed actually because our biggest concern always using bolt.diy is the speed let me just show you the speed actually because our biggest concern using bolt.diy is always speed but with these free large language models using open router the speed is absolutely amazing so i have this simple prompt to create a landing page i'll just click on enter look at the speed i mean it is actually better than if you are using something like lm studio locally on your computer this is going to be an absolutely beginner friendly tutorial i'll give you a detailed step by step guide that how you can set up bolt.diy and then how you can use any free large language models from open router absolutely for free so before you start please subscribe to this youtube channel and hit that like button as well for this particular video our goal is to reach 1500 likes or right, to download and install bolt.diy just go to this url which is bolt DIY, and then it will actually reload you to this github directory you need to install this github directory on your computer i have already created a lot of videos on how to set up bolt.diy but in this video i'll just repeat those steps first thing that we need to do you need to clone this directory you need to download this directory locally on your computer to do that what you can do you can simply just copy the url of this directory next Next step is just open a folder, any folder on your computer, either you are using Windows or Mac, just create an empty folder. Then just open your terminal, doesn't matter if you are using Windows or Mac, just click on open terminal and this terminal will open. Next step is just write this command git clone and then paste that URL that you just copied and press enter and now it has cloned that directory locally on your computer. Next thing that you need to do, just close this terminal, let me just like uh, make life easier for you, just close this terminal. And then just open this terminal and then click on right click and then click on open terminal again. So this is what it will do. It will just like open this terminal in your directory. You could do by doing CD and then write name bolt.diy as well. But I just like showed you the easiest way. All right. So next step that we need to do now, once we have like our directory downloaded our GitHub repository downloaded on your computer, next step that you need to do, you need to go back to your GitHub repository, bolt.diy GitHub repository, then just scroll down and you need to do simply just copy this command from here just copy that command just scroll down and come to this section running the application and from here just copy this command from here then just paste this command inside your terminal now next step is just go back to your github directory copy this command from here pnp npm install and then paste that command inside your terminal what it will do it will just install all of the required libraries so simply just click and press on enter so it will just like it will take it usually takes like few minutes maybe like two to three minutes depends on it, on your internet speed but it should not take longer than three to four minutes maximum all right it took around four minutes but the installation is done now next step is simply just you need to run this command now which is pnp run dev and just open that pnpm run dev press enter and now what it will do it will just run this project and give you a local host url simply just copy this local host url from here and then what you need to do next what which is actually recommended here by their documentation is to download a chrome canary browser so there is this browser by chrome it's called chrome canary you can just go to this url and download a chrome canary browser you can like use google chrome as well but you can totally use chrome canary in case if you face any issues on google chrome then just open this url inside your chrome browser or chrome canary browser just paste that url in here and now it should just open your bolt.io now once it will open for the first time it won't give you any options to choose any providers or any large language models it won't give you any options so what you need to do you need to simply just press on this reload button again and now it should give you that option to like choose like maybe an open router or maybe something like like all of these large language models in here so next thing is we need to go to open router and then get an api key from there just go to open router.ai just sign up using your google account click on keys section in here just click on create a key and then name your key something maybe i'll name it bolt and create a key copy this key from here then next thing that you need to do you need to simply just click on this pencil icon in here i have already provided that key actually but i'll just provide that again click on enter and then that's it now we have provided our key next thing is we can simply just now choose any of the large language models which are actually available for free 
to easily filter all of the free large language models in here you can simply just enter free just type free in here and then you can see there is a dolphin 3.0 by mistral it's a 24 billion parameters model and this is absolutely free to use but the context is smaller which is 32k only uh, you need to find something like deep seek r1 which is deep seek r1 distilled with llama 70b this is perfectly fine to use then you can directly like use deep seek r1 free which is uh, which has 163k context and then you can find this one gemini flash 2.0 experimental which has a 1000 48k context this is the best model so far among all of these freely available models on open router just choose that now just give your prompt and that's it so let's just give it a prompt create a landing page for my ai music generator app my app is available on android and ios i want you to create a very detailed landing page for my app so yeah let's just give it a basic input and then press on enter and then now you can see it is fast enough for me i mean i am happy with this speed this is super fast for me this is really amazing i i know that we have been using lm studio and olama to use all of those large language models locally but i'm i'm super happy with this speed using open router in, in case if you face any problem let's suppose if you are like if you just reach your credit limits to use like any of these free large language models you can simply just then like switch to a different one but this is absolutely absolutely up. so yeah this is so far the best way to use bold diy locally on your computer and that too absolutely for free we have tried using various methods in past but the speed of bold diy was not that impressive because most of the times you're actually using lm studio and to run a large language model on lm studio in a good speed you need a better gpu so that's a restriction for most of us but using open router but using these free large language models on open router is actually best way so far to use bold diy absolutely for free i hope you like this video please leave a comment in description if you have any questions i see you next video Bye. -bye.